Morning guys, Joe here with Black Rock Central Railroad, again. Uh, in case anybody forgot, this is the second part of uh, the Jack Jack build, or the second building anyway, the REA transfer building. Uh, this is a complete four-sided building, but we're going to make this into a background building like everything else that Jack has been getting here lately. And uh, I'm going to show you what we've got started with here so far. Get the box out of the way here. Knowing that the building can only be two inches wide, what we did was just kind of uh, make a base plate that's two inches wide glued the one dock on here and then I'm actually building this as two separate buildings to be opposite of each other parts here out of the uh, paint booth this particular building will it on there like so and then we're taking an end wall and let's make sure we're in the camera here so you can see this we took an end wall and added brick to the sides of it that way when we put this in here it will come out that way and like I say the other building that we're going to make will be just like this only the taller section will be over on that end so once we get all the windows glued in here and get everything else done to it the doors and everything else then we'll uh, show you how we're proceeding with it but that's what we look like so far and uh, we'll bring you back as the need arises. So for now, that's it. Talk to you later on. Bye for now. Okay, guys. This will be the uh, end of tonight anyway. I think I've worked hard enough today. This is uh, the first of two buildings. This is one side of the front completed anyway with the exception of a uh, roof for it and the roof over top of the loading dock. That's currently sitting in the paint booth drying. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to use for the uh, roof on this thing yet. I may just go down and get me a stop sign and, uh, or a for sale sign and cut one out and stick it on there. But. Uh, I've started on the uh, foundation or the loading dock area for the second one and it's also sitting in paint booth and uh, one, once uh, everything gets done here I think Jack Jack's going to be super happy with this we're going to be a little over uh, two foot long almost three feet long by the time it's all said and done so for the time being we're going to call it quits for tonight this is Joe from Black Rock Central Railroad. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you all later. Bye for now. Okay, final reveal. The latest Jack Jack project. Uh, this is all one kit. This was the uh, REA Express office building or warehouse, whatever you care to call it. Originally, in kit form, this is supposed to be uh, 12 inches by, I think it's 5 inches. And uh, we uh, decided we weren't going to build it that way. So, what you see here is a building that's about 32 and a half inches long. The two uh, end pieces are actually the front and back of the office building. That we just kind of... Uh, changed them around a little bit and brought them out even with the dock 
That way everything there is two inches wide, which is the max I can go on uh, Jack Jack's project. So let's see if we can't uh, do a little bit here. And we just kind of uh, pan from one end to the other. It may not be a, a perfect building, but hey, for a background building, I think it came out pretty damn good. So for now, that's it. Until the next build. Which right now, I'm going to clean this workbench off a little bit. Get this thing packaged up. And hopefully get it in the mail sometime tomorrow. Or actually UPS it. Because I've got the uh, other building that has to go to. And plus this one here. Yeah, that'll be two boxes going to Jack Jack. And then I'm going to get back on my cabooses for a while. <laughs> So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. It's Joe from Black Rock Central. Have a good one. Bye for now.